everybody how's it going david here and welcome to another reaction this episode we are diving into breaking bad season three episode number 10 called fly hopefully you've been enjoying the series hopefully you are having a wonderful day don't forget to like comment subscribe head on over to patreon for the full uncut unedited reactions over there episodes extra early over there as well with that being said buckle your seat belts let's ride Well, it's definitely Skylar's voice. No? Well, it's clearly Jesse. My God, he got over there quick. Chris Wright. Man, cleaning day must suck okay. with all this equipment. No, maybe nothing gets built. What about um, evaporation? Yeah, it wouldn't account for this much. The materials aren't out that long. What about the uh, the other one? The drops. Like on, um, like on that, like cold beer. Condensation? Yeah. No. <laughs> He's trying, man. Are you coming? Yeah, in a minute. All right, see you tomorrow. Jesse, your best bet would have been to stick around and clear him from your name. <laughs> My God. Well, you tried. That has to be one of the most annoying things in your ear. You don't think a fly is going to see that coming? Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh my god. I knew it. He never left. Whoa. A fly, Jesse. A fly. A fly. <laughs> what do you mean? A fly, like, like, what do you mean? A fly. A fly. A house fly. <laughs> Be on the lookout. Like, uh, one fly. One fly. See, keeping our cook clean and our product unadulterated, we need to take this very seriously. Now, do you understand? Is that your fly saver? Yes, it is. This is a swatter. <laughs> you can leave me to deal with this myself, or you can help me. But you are right. We are running out of time. So I need your answer right now. Okay. At least make me another fly swatter. I can't believe this episode's about a fly. Legit, a fly. Okay, to put in hot dogs, huh? Pig lips and assholes. <laughs> I say, hey, really? Have at it, bitches, because I love hot dogs. And, uh, you know. Oh, so you're much. making way too what much you noise. Do? You're oh, making way too much okay. noise. Leave the flies, what? Get it. How am I going to get it with my hand? You want me to get it? Ooh. Yes. It's going to be. <laughs> it's going to be one good hit. What? This is a raisin. No. Look, I definitely got it, man. Right? Oh, oh man. no. He's got some skills. <laughs> oh, that. 
He's got mad skills, yo. Yeah. Hey! If you're not gonna help me, stay out of my way! Hey! Are you serious? Yo, There's no way he's serious. El Axo. El <laughs> it broke. It broke. Oh, oh. Got a bottle. We hang him up all over the place. He won't be able to resist. I sure hope we have enough. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say, uh, yeah. And say, yeah. I mean, we got See quite you. a bit. Possum. Big freaky looking bitch. Hey, since when did they change it to opossum? Right. What's when did they when change I was, it? I was coming possum. Just possum. You know, old possum makes it sound like he's Irish or something. <laughs> Yo, I could have sworn it was just possum. Right at it. Right? I mean, it thinks it's fooling you. That's what they do. I mean, they, they play dead or whatever. It's just so, so lame. Well, is there a discernible point to this story? <laughs> Yo, Walt is so mean to him. Be arriving at sometime in the near future to uh be that way but it turned out that the um the cancer had spread to her brain and that was why it um the task perfect moment and it passed me right by yeah i i had to have enough to the whole point none of this none of this makes any sense if I if I didn't have enough be careful it's odd I never do that go to a bar alone I just walked in sat down I never told you you never told him what are you even talking, talking about of course, mm. I didn't know it at the time. Mm. He was just some guy in a bar. Fall back. But I just, I didn't put it together until after the crash when he was all over the news. How can that be random? Oh, hey, sit down. No, no. No, it's... Uh... He's going to hit the floor very hard. Oh. Hit this man down, Jesse. <laughs> Camera view of a fly. He's not coming down. Must be Thailand hot up there. That's why he likes it. Thailand's hot, right? <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry for what? Being a lunatic? <laughs> no, he's about to tell her. Or he's about to tell him. Sorry about Jane. Success! We got that little fucker. Yeah! Oh, zap! Somebody got caught, yo! You see that, Mr. Mr. White is out. Mr. White is out. <laughs> yo, he is knocked out. Well, I guess it's Jesse's turn. So it's almost like Walt knows. All right, season three, episode number 10 of Breaking Bad. <laughs> I, th I'm pro I promise you guys, there is only one show that could do something like that. Like that episode we just watched. And still give us a performance of like an 8 slash 9 as far as a rating goes. Literally, this episode was us dealing with a fly. If you would have ever told me before I watched this episode, hey, 
It's going to be an episode where literally Walt and Jesse are just trapped inside the, well, not trapped, but they, they stay inside the lab trying to kill a fly. Story-wise, I would have been like, what? But then if you had told me it was Breaking Bad, I would have been like, you know what? If there's a show that could pull it off, it's Breaking Bad. And what do you know? They pull it off. Some way, somehow, staying in a freaking lab the entire episode, chasing a fly, trying to kill a fly. And it was great. The episode was great. The episode was freaking amazing. Oh, my God. So, to me, one of the more annoying, most annoying sounds has to be something buzzing in your ear. Whether it's a bee, whether it's a fly, mosquito, whatever the case may be. Just constant buzzing in your ear will drive you nuts. It would drive me nuts. It may not drive you nuts, but it drives me nuts. And so, the fact that Walt was just stood a whole day, overnight everything, trying to kill this fly is ridiculous. It's crazy. And the fact that he knows that Jesse's stealing. I, I'm almost 100% certain he knows that Jesse's stealing. He has to know. He absolutely has to know that Jesse's stealing. Because he wouldn't have told him that at the end there. He wouldn't have said, hey, if they find out, I can't protect you. He wouldn't have said that. So he must know that. Or at least he must be so good at how much he overcooks that he realizes Jesse's taking some. Crazy though, ridiculous. There was a lot of moments where I thought uh, Walt was going to actually open up and say, I killed her. I watched her die. I didn't turn her on her side. I let her, you know what I mean, choke up on her throw up or whatever. I thought for sure he was going to open up and say it, but he didn't. And I don't know about for you guys, but the entire time Jesse was on that ladder, my God, my anxiety was going crazy. I'm like, oh, he's going to fall. Oh, he's going to fall. Literally an episode about a fly. A fly, people. A freaking fly. And it's great. And it's great. Amazing. And we only had two actors in this whole episode. It's crazy, man. Freaking crazy. That's why I say, like, it's not so much that I don't care for dialogue. Because I do, you know what I mean, care for dialogue. You have to care about dialogue when it comes to uh, shows. Because at the end of the day, the dialogue is what's telling the story. And in a show like this where it, it so it's so desperate, not desperate, it's so dependent on the dialogue... Literally, that's all we got this episode was a dialogue. It was back and forth between Walt and Jesse. Nothing else was going on. I mean, I guess a, a, an action scene when when Walt stole the keys from from Jesse and locked him out. Oh, my God, that was crazy. But otherwise, everything is just the conversations being had. And and. There's just something about Walt and Jesse when it comes to their chemistry that. No pun intended. Their chemistry is so well together that when 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 I watch them talking back and forth, I'm just enjoying every bit of it. It's like I, it's like I take where we are now and I and I remember where we were back then. I remember when Jane was around. I, and it's like my God. And look, we're only what three episodes, three more episodes away from the season finale of season three. Like we're we're moving along, and it's been fun as f- oh my god, it's been one hell of a ride. Literally, I can't I can't get over the fact I I know I keep bringing it back, but I can't get over the fact that we literally just watched an episode about a fly, and I want to give this episode a nine. <laughs> it's crazy. It's freaking nuts. Nobody was here. Nobody but Walt and Jesse were in this episode, and it was outstanding it was great so desperate to get this fly that he falls from way up to, oh my god just so many so many good good scenes just back and forth talking back and forth talking and the fact that jesse so we can all agree that that jesse doesn't make the best decisions and some of us might say jesse's dumb as hell 
I may feel that way. But when you sit there and really listen to Jesse sometimes, he's not that dumb. He may not understand certain things, and a lot of the things that Walt understands because he's a chemist, uh, a chemistry teacher or whatever. Look, sometimes Walt talks, and I'm like, uh, what? <laughs> what is he saying? So for Jesse to be able to even obtain all the information that Walt tells him and, and, and is able to to cook on his own now. And I know a lot of that is just, uh, you know, repetition and doing it so often that, you know, it's muscle memory, but the fact that he could just pick it up and he's actually understanding some of the terminology and, and things like that. It's crazy. It's, it's ridiculous, man. Like this show is nuts and I haven't even watched. I'm almost certain there's more nut shit that's going to happen, but I literally, for like the hundredth time, we watched a freaking episode about a fly, and I'm giving the episode a nine. If that does not speak on how great this fucking show is, I don't know what else would. Literally a fly, people. A freaking fly, man. But that's the episode. Hopefully you enjoyed the review. Hopefully you enjoyed the reaction. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Head on over to Patreon for the full uncut, unedited reactions over there. Episodes extra early over there as well. With that being said, I'll catch you guys later. Peace, guys.